I've been putting the kids to work all night, unloading groceries, packing, getting all the things ready for our trip. Apparently we're taking a little break over here. Dad's just spending an evening in the spa salon. What's up, everybody? What's up? <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to another day at the Bingham House. It's Monday morning over here. I've been up for about... I've been up for like 30 minutes. I'm not kidding. <laughs> I've been up for a really long time to still feel like I'm asleep. Mondays are just those days, you know? You had a good, it means you had a good weekend, though. Okay. We had a full weekend. Mom's celebrating birthday. a really special lady. Annabelle? Someone's mom. Annabelle? Look at that hair. Check out that hair, everybody. Can we get a round of applause for Jeremy <laughs> curls? I kind of love them. We're off to another day in the life of physical therapy with Turin Bingham. He's feeling better every single day, wouldn't you say? Yeah, getting a little better. Actually, getting a lot better. Two and a half more weeks, we go back to the orthopedic surgeon, see how much longer he's got to stay out of soccer. In the meantime, he's just Hanging out. Living his best life over here. Being a great lazy person. It's great. <laughs> I gotta give you more chores, I guess. All right. Meanwhile, at home, we are doing some cleaning around here, a little catch up from the fun weekend we had. Landon's favorite thing to do as of this summer is help with the laundry. Isn't that right, Lando? Yeah. Every day he says, Mom, is there any laundry that you need done? Mom, can we please do some laundry? And I'm like, I need a little bit of whatever medicine you're taking because laundry is not my favorite chore around here. But in all seriousness, the laundry... <laughs> Where did you come from? That scared me so bad. Woo! The laundry system in the Bingham household has changed for the better. All of the kids have been helping with their own laundry, putting their own laundry away, hanging up their own shirts, folding their own laundry, and it is the best thing ever. <laughs> All right, you guys, today has been a bit of a whirlwind. I took Ava to another dance audition. We think we might be moving over to a new place this year. She's gonna be on the dance team. She's gonna be doing tumbling. Justin's eating dinner over here. I also went on another little birthday celebration with my friends, a little lunch and shopping date because it's still the month of June. Celebrations just keep coming. <laughs> I have the best friends and family on the planet and my sister still wants to take me on a hike and take me to lunch. I seriously have been so spoiled and I'm eating up every bit of it. But Justin and I tonight are scrambling to get ready for a trip to Lake Powell tomorrow. We're going back, people. This has been a trip we have had planned for a little while to go with our friends, Chris and Emily and their family. We share the boat with them for those of you who are new here. And we've been so excited. It's over the 4th of July. We love their family. It's going to be so fun and a couple days ago, we had a little hiccup. Big hiccup, actually. Big hiccup. So Chris ended up in the emergency room. With On a Friday, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. He had appendicitis. Yeah, he had appendicitis. He had to get his appendix removed. And when they went in there, they found out that it had already ruptured. Which is not good for those that know have ever had it. It's really not good. It leaks poison into your body. Very dangerous. Anyway, long story short, I don't think they can come to Powell anymore. They're considering it. He wouldn't be able to swim in the water. He could get in for a short amount of time and get right back out, the doctor said. So he's still debating on whether they're gonna come because the kids would still have fun and all of that, but I don't blame them if they don't end up coming. So they're kind of up in the air. We're still going, even if it's just us. Celebrate the 4th of July in beautiful Lake Powell. Which will be a ton of fun, but for sure a little bit of a damper because we were excited to go with them. Yeah, it's about who you're with, not necessarily where you go. So obviously, you know, we love being with the family, but I think the kids were excited to hang out with their kids too. But that's okay, we'll figure it out. Before every trip, you gotta do a Costco haul. Get all the snacks, drinks, lunches for the boat. It's pretty similar to what I got last time, but I'll show you guys what I got.
I've been putting the kids to work all night, unloading groceries, packing, getting all the things ready for our trip. Apparently we're taking a little break over here. Dad's just spending an evening in the spa salon. Girls lounge. Girls lounge. The girls lounge. <laughs> what are you doing? Just cleaning out all my earwax. Just cleaning his ears. What about my nose? Uh, not your nose, for sure not. What about my boogies? No, you, you do it. <laughs> you do it, you do it. This is, this is not full service. You get no tip. <laughs> you do it. The same one she used for your ears? Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, should we go see what we got at Costco? Okay, the key for boating trips is keeping things simple. So. I think you missed the simple part there, babe. I did not miss the simple part. When I'm at home, I make sure things are a little more nutritious when we are on the boat. We go for simplicity. We don't have a lot of cooler space. The ice melts really, really fast. So the biggest thing that I bought today are drinks for an army. Justin loves this, but the body armors were on sale. They were on coupon. Oh yeah. So I got two of each. We've got our body armor lights for Justin and I and our regular body armors for the kids. I actually really like these. The reason I've been buying them lately is because the kids and Justin love Gatorade. But Gatorade has all the dyes in it, which I think is completely unnecessary. It adds no nutritional value. It doesn't taste better. It just looks a cool color and it's terrible for you. So these are not artificially dyed. Much better for you, but kind of similar to a Gatorade. So switch it over to body armor. Then we've got some waters. The sport bottles with the little... Thank you. Twist top. We're on coupon. They're gonna be so great. So we got all of our drinks. We're gonna stay hydrated. One of my family's favorites, specifically somebody. Named Justin. <laughs> they love these little mini cookies, so we got two. The theme of today was two. I got two of everything. We also got these little protein shakes. Again, when I'm at home, I make them myself, but these are just convenient and great. We're on the go. We'll bring some of those on the boat. We've got just little mini snackaroos. The kids are gonna be excited about these. Scoop. We've got Ritz Bits. No, We've got snacks. Chips Ahoy. We've got, I'm reading this all backwards, Nutter Butters, Oreo Minis. Because we are not going hungry in like college. <laughs> we got the snack-sized chips. I would say that amongst all of these, that's onions the are going to be the favorite. Told ya. Onions. Told ya. Hmm. I don't know. We'll guess we'll and see. Doritos. Got these little smashed avocado. Because every time I go to Jimmy John's or I make a sandwich, I love avocado on it. But this will be so much easier for the boat. Also, got these little mini packs of chicken breast bites. Really easy, quick protein snack. We got G2Gs. You know we love G2Gs around here. Great healthy snack. And this right here is a hint, a little sneak peek at the makeover I'm gonna do in our pantry. We have an amazing pantry. It's not organized. I have no bins. I have no storage containers. I talked to my neighbor across the street. She said, start with some OXO containers. So starting with those so when I get back it's gonna be awesome but my favorite very 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 favorite purchase at Costco tonight How is not is a million and a half it's not a food item this is something I've had my eye on for a long time we don't need it right now because Turin is injured and everyone else isn't playing sports this summer but we found some chairs at Costco that are rockers so we're gonna open it up give you a little tour All right, Ava, what do you think? Okay. So it folds up, it's like a little glider. Yeah, this is what the bottom looks like. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> You're, are you laughing at his hair? <laughs> I, I don't, I don't know. I'll be honest, I've sat in the rocker before. I think, I think, and I I'm, think I that think I'm this, glad Costco has a good return policy. You don't love it? No, I think, I want the ones that recline, like they have little pistons on the back that you can actually, this is actually pretty comfortable. Okay, but are you remembering the same one I am? I sat in one of our friend's chairs and it seemed like it rocked a little more. Yes, it has these little pistons in the back and you can also, you can almost like lean backwards in. Yeah. These are comfy though. Honest review here. We might have to do a side by side. We might have to get the one that our friend has. I wanna say it's from like Dick's Sporting Goods. We'll do a side by side, give you our honest review. Cause I know a lot of you are going to sports games all the time. Being comfortable <laughs> is where it's at. Okay, just so we are giving a very clear review here. It's very comfortable. You can kind of lean back but 
it doesn't rock as much as the other one, which may not really be that big of a deal. All right, you guys, we are very excited to depart to Lake Powell. I'm not sure if you can take me seriously with the hair that Ava did. <laughs> but you guys, Ava we paints my nails, she does my hair, and I kind of just don't take it out just because I want her to, you know, I don't know how much I love and appreciate all of her <laughs> beauty makeovers. But guys, we're heading to Lake Powell tomorrow. Super excited, going back. Guys, it's kind of our happy place. So join us on the road trip tomorrow to Lake Powell with the whole family. TV down whether some friends are coming or not. Either way, we're gonna have a blast. You're coming with us. Subscribe down below. See you tomorrow. See ya. See ya. See ya. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>